Um, and, and then there was the whole aspect, the whole sort of crux, if you will, of the episode was this, this idea of this, you know, this pocket dimension, whatever you want to call it, this offshoot, being a conscious universe. I was absolutely compelled and fascinated by this. I was on the edge of my seat, you know, even though the doctor's explanation of it was absolutely utmost goofy and corny, Matt Smith-esque levels of, of such, um, I thought it was absolutely fascinating. Right up until <laughs> the god-awful Planet of Spiders-esque special effect of the frog. What, you saying you didn't like that part? Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm saying. Does that mean we can't be friends? The doctor said she'd be my friend. Well, I mean, I don't, I don't hate you. So, friends then? I guess. Oh, goody, goody, good. All right, shut up. <laughs> I mean, it was, it was insane. That whole sequence was absolute insanity. But I have to give kudos where kudos are due. And that is to Jody friggin' Whitaker, the 13th Doctor, who, acting in a scene against this little puppet frog, was the personification of sincerity. She believes and, and is putting forth, I believed, everything she was thinking, doing, and saying. I'm sure my face was awash with, with incredulity and just shock at the complete and utter disbelief as to what I was witnessing at that point. And, and the only thing that really tempered it was Jody's, you know, this, this sincerity of her performance, this, this being grounded in the, the unreality of the absurdity of this whole circumstance.